Connor Patterson here reporting for FinalWhistle.ie as Dundalk run out comfortable 4-1 winners against league's bottom side UCD this uh, bank holiday Monday. The result puts an end to Stephen Donnelly's side's uh, four-game losing streak and it was a very comprehensive, very easy victory in the end. Despite the scoreline though, UCD did take the lead after seven minutes. Danny Norris helping the ball into the uh, into the Dundalk box. Defensive mix-up from the defence as Andy Boyle looked to kind of header the ball back to Nathan Shepard and the Dundalk old. Didn't put enough on it. Shepard hesitated. And UCD striker Jake Doyle said thank you very much and slotted home for a very easy goal. Definitely, the opening goal definitely rattled the home support and Dundalk. Their play was a bit scrappy for a while. They eventually did manage to compose themselves helped largely by a penalty awarded to the Lily Whites just after about 20 minutes into the game. The Finnish player Lee Coco was felled in the box by Alex Nolan after he was kicked on the back of the shin, up to Patrick Homan very comfortably to send Keen Moore the wrong way. Then, after about 40 minutes, the turnaround was completed for Dundalk. Patrick Homan involved again this time as he headed the ball in towards the box. Uh, it was the Dundalk winger, um, Daniel Kelly, who was the first to react ahead of the UCD ball. He was very sharp all afternoon. And he slotted home from close range. Then into the second half, Dundalk wrapped up all three points fairly quickly into the second half. Patrick Hoban again getting on the scoreline. Lovely bit of build-up play from Dundalk. Um, Lee, uh, Kelly set back the ball to our, the fullback Archie Davies, who, who fired the ball into the box. Patrick Hoban with a great time to run lovely and headed home. And then a couple of minutes later, he delivered a very similar goal. This time it was the other fullback, Daryl Leahy, with the delivery. And Patrick Hoban headed home. That makes uh, that gives uh, Patrick Hoban his 142nd goal for Dundalk in all competitions, and he equals the all-time club goal-scoring record of Joey Donnelly. He takes the match ball home today and gives uh, Dundalk all three points. Full-time at Oriel Park, Dundalk 2-4, ECD 1.